hello hello guys uh here i have a nice lenovo let me show you this is a very very lovely machine the problem with this laptop uh, it's not turning on let me show you all right the charger has been connected the light today is blinking i'm sure you can see the lights it's blinking one way all right i don't know why it's blinking let's check again the charging light is blinking when you press the power button is turned on see the lights but nothing on the screen and then it's quickly shut down see the lights and then shut down it keeps on doing the same thing over and over and over and over and over again anyway what i'm gonna do i'll remove the charger okay turning on without the charger just press the power button okay i think now it's off complete let's see let's wait out them um, i'm gonna press a uh, power button for a long time yeah i believe it's now off anyway i was looking for some applications here i think i need the tiktok uh, let me download tiktok what else i need youtube guys you, you you have to have a youtube i have this phone here uh they gave me this phone i need bolts i'll need bolts on this small phone i'll need messenger after messenger what else i'll need i'll need a gmail account i like this iphone it's old but anyway let's see what we are dealing with all right let's go ahead remove everything here we go this is the inside of that machine of this machine uh, i hope you can see here it's got some built-in memories guys i'm telling you things are changing this is a ddr4 built-in memory and it has a slot guys i'm telling you let me repeat this again things are changing the technology is changing a lot you have to be prepared buy those stencil learn to repoil and then um, to put back the pga chips remove them and then put them back we have to learn all of those things let's go ahead so the first thing that i'm gonna do i'm gonna remove the battery we have to remove the battery use a plastic ply tool there don't be like me i'm the only one who normally use this mentally piece and what else do you have to do remove a built-in battery and shorts okay let me short those guys let me short this with a, a tweezers make sure it's clean it's neat there's a contact wanna be sure Let's short it. We're gonna hold here, short those two pins, small pins there where the BIOS battery connects. Okay. Anyway, I'm enjoying this iPhone, guys. I won't lie, it's very old. I like it. Uh they just gave it to me. Uh, let's see. Let's check the apps. <sighs> I was downloading the apps from the from the app store okay wait do i have youtube i used youtube a lot i have to make sure that i that i do have youtube what about tiktok oh tiktok is downloading 
uh, what about polls i need polls i think polls are still downloading but anyway i'll see shots it does that does that's been there for a long time Shut it down, 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 down. Okay, I think this is now enough. Let's uh, let's pull it up. Connect the charger. Okay, we do have a light. The machine went off. Turning on again. It went off. Things gonna turn on again. Okay, this thing do does receive power. I'm not sure if you can notice. Just observe there. This thing does receive power and then quickly shut down. Let's observe one more time. Okay, you saw. Okay hope you saw there and uh, the hard drive just goes off quickly as well I think the problem here might be the 5 volts maybe short set or something but the first thing the first thing that I'm gonna do I'm gonna remove the hard drive Anyway, this cable was glued down there with a sticky glue. Now let's turn on the machine without. Okay, wait, let's hold the power, the power button. Maybe the power button might help. Hard drive is out. Hold the power button. You count it maybe for 30 seconds. And then you start. While I'm holding, let's check my phone. I'm enjoying this phone. Let me hide my password. Okay. <sighs> oh, Dropbox. I think I will need Dropbox. What else? I don't need games. The all. Okay, let's connect the charger. Turning on. And then it went off again. Turn on. I can see the light went off again okay it's turning on then going off turning on see the lights here turning on off off on off on off 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 see the light and then off on off okay it keeps on doing the same thing on and then off all right all right don't panic i think the five volts is shorted we have to check so in this case you check for 3.3 .3 and 5 volts the 5 volts might be shorted you put one prop to ground start there you check there okay the 3.3 .3 and the 5 volts seems to be fine no issues no issues here no shorts what about here it seems to be no short bios pin number pin number eight is fine 
let me show you the bios pin number eight this is what you do on the bios and this is where the pin number eight you will see a bios chip you will see a dot and the opposite to dot you will see pin number eight you will check there uh, and see if there's a shot or not i, I did already i've checked so now what do i have to to double check seem to be a short uh i think i think there's a short on the okay let me do this let me remove and then to cut removing it to cut let's remove let's remove uh, I think let's check this laptop how many check this laptop how much uh, M's 2.25 M's All right, the charger is fine. I don't see anything on the charger. Oh, now what else? What do I check? Because we're gonna go through a motherboard, a disconnected uh, keyboard, and I remove the CMOS, the CMOS battery, and the. Uh, Okay, it went off. Okay, turning on. It went off. Okay, it's I hope you can see what is going on here. Turns on and off, turns on and off, turns on and off. Keep on boot looping. Anyway, it was done stress. And the fan spins, stop, spin, and then stops. So what we're gonna do we're gonna play a game one prop to ground check there on the 3.3 on the 5 volt 5.5 5.3 is fine what about the other one the 3.3 Okay, what about the CPU? Okay, CPU does turn on and then quickly shut down. I'm sure you saw 0 0.65, just observe there. Okay, I don't know why I can't see now, but I saw. Okay, you see there, 1 point something, then it drops to 0. See, for something and then drop to zero. What about the other one? What about this? 1.09. Okay, it's fine. What about this? 8 volts. Steady for charging the battery. What about the RAM? Zero point two. Okay, let's see the RAM. Okay, 0 0.2 on the RAM. The BIOS pin number 8, 2.4. Okay, let's check. Pin number 1, 3.3, 3, 2, 3. Okay, the BIOS is not jumping. Seems fine. see okay seems to be fine okay hold on seems like there's a display now 
So the machine is turning spinning one way very fast. All right, guys, so without a waste of time, <laughs> I told you I programmed the BIOS and the machine worked. Let me show you. Okay, so what we do now, you connect a charger. Hold on. We do get a light as always. So you can see there is a light there. Now let's check for a display. This time a light is not going away. Turning on one way, one way, one way. There it is, Lenovo checking media. Anyway, now we know that if the BIOS is corrupted, the machine will also behave like that. Turn on, shut down, turn on, shut down, turn on, shut down one way because it's got some corrupted files. So it keeps on, on looping one way, one way, one way, one way. But anyway, I'm going to leave it like that. Please, before you go, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I love you so much, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.